Which one of these two statements do you agree with more? One, love is a feeling that just happens naturally. Mm. Or two, love is a choice that you make. Mm, it's definitely a choice. Damn. These are about all types of love? I actually thought about that too. I'm like, that's too complicated. Let's narrow it down to romantic relationships. Okay. So well, are they just a choice? That's are, a choice. That's think, definitely a choice. You think so? Yes. Because there have been women I didn't give a f about. And then I made them my girlfriend. And then they dumped me and now I'm heartbroken. Like, I didn't even give a f about this lady before I've at all. In, I've actually been in that same I fucking hate it. I'm in a situation right now. My girl, my ex-girlfriend now, I didn't, she's been trying to be my girlfriend for years. When I was married, I would, I cheated on my ex-wife with her. Yeah. And she was trying to be my girlfriend. And I just never, I would always say, no, no, I want to be in a relationship with you. No, I don't want to. They give a f about her. And then now we break up and now I'm a heartbroken. Like, why am I heartbroken? I chose to be like this. I wasn't in love with this lady at all. From my perspective, that sounds more like a feeling that just happens, though, right? No, because I chose to pour my feelings into her. I made myself feel like this. Oh, like, I, I think I think myself. I think I see what you're saying now. So, like, yeah. originally it was a no. What made you decide to like force yourself to feel that way? Well, sometimes when somebody loves you a lot, you like I gotta reciprocate this. Huh? And sometimes you start out faking. Yeah. And then it just becomes real. Like, damn, I really love this person now. I also feel like like love, like if we're gonna break down the word love philosophically, mm -hmm. what what would it mean to you, like love? Okay, now my definition yeah. for love now would be like like prioritizing somebody's wants and needs over yours. That's like, what I would too. Yeah, which is a choice. That's a choice. That's a choice. Yeah. That's a full on choice. Yeah. But I think um people just misuse the word a lot. Like people say they're in love or they say they love somebody and no they, no, they don't. Have you ever been able to fall in love with somebody that started very lustfully? Like it was just you guys hooked up fast and you Yes. Yeah. This my ex girlfriend now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It was nothing but we we didn't we didn't have conversations. Like like I said, I would so put it like this. Me and her first started messing around when I was maybe fourteen yeah. or fifteen. And then we had just hooked up on and off throughout the years. Yeah. And like I said, when I was with my ex-wife, I cheated on my ex-wife with her a couple of times. But it was just sex. We had meet at a hotel, f around, talk for a little bit, and then I go about my business. She had a fiance at the time. It was just a normal just hookup. And then it turned into this whole thing. And you know what I blame it on? COVID. It's COVID's fault. <laughs> it's COVID. Because then we just were hooking up all the time. Because like there was nothing else to do. There's nothing to do. My job shut down. Her job shut down. We just started hooking the f up. Then I made her my girlfriend, and boom. But then it did. But then, in the long story, it didn't work out. So it yeah. it started. It, yeah. I guess you could fall in love with somebody if it's lust based in the beginning, but it might not be a good formula for long term. It's not. It's not a good formula because uh, that means y'all just like having sex with each other. Yeah. You you might not like like anything else about them. What about the other way though? What if you meet somebody that? You love talking to them, oh, but you're but not. The sex ain't that. I've been there before too, yo. Or what if this? How about this? What if the sex actually is good, but they're not like attractive to you, but the, but they're still good. Oh, I've been there before too, <laughs> yo. Damn, these this is these are some great questions. <laughs>